Even if you dream, it won't come true anyway. So just accept your reality and be satisfied with your life. Some people will talk to you like this. They say that's the only way to be happy and to empty your minds. Uh, however, I don't agree with this teaching at all. Can you change your past? You can't change your past. What about the present? Can you change your present right away? No, you can't, right? There's only one way to change yourself. You have to go to the future. The future constantly approaches you, right? But as this future approaches you, you must control it before it reaches you. You must go to the future, and you have to create a future that you want. Everyone can dream, but other people trample on that dream of yours. They say, that's ridiculous. That's nonsense. It's impossible for me to drive a luxurious car. How can someone like me live in a 200 square meter home? People are killing their own dreams. But what about people that have succeeded? They say, yes, I can succeed. I can live a life that gives back to society. Yes, I can make 30,000, 50,000, or even $70,000 a month. Some people think this way, and they believe that they can truly succeed. It may start from a small thought, but there are people who cultivate that thought. It's not about one's educational background or talents. It's the difference of the power of thought. You must train these mental muscles. In the beginning, the potential of those thoughts will be very small. You must train your mental muscles to keep growing your dreams. You don't succeed with the amount of knowledge. You succeed with confidence and with desperateness. If you are certain of success in your mind, then you will be transformed. If you can vividly imagine, in your minds, the final image of how you want to succeed, then your body will react and your expressions will change. Your mannerisms will change like that of a successful person. Our bodies react according to the thoughts we have in our minds. That is why, though it did not happen in reality, our bodies will change and react as if it actually happened. You have to write down in your life scenario what kind of life it is you want to live. You have to create a movie in your mind. You might have doubts at first when you write your life scenario. Can I really be a person that makes $50,000 a month? I really hope it will become a reality. What if I fail? So it might be difficult at first to write your life scenario. Some people will put down their pen many times. Some won't be able to write a single line. But you still need to muster up the courage to write. Even if you really don't feel like doing it, then you must change the way you feel. You can't just ignore this issue just because you don't feel like writing down your dreams. Even if it's a low chance, even if the rate of success is only 1% or 10%, you must hold on to that possibility and you must go towards that path. You don't succeed because of the success rate. Though the success rate is low, you just have to take the right path. You've imagined it because it's possible. That's why you need to write down your dreams, and you must make a resolve that your dreams will come true. The best way to make that resolve is to declare your dreams to your friends and family. There's a high chance that they will call you crazy. Yeah, but... If you've never heard that you're crazy while living in this world, that means you've never really lived a passionate life. 
A person who lives passionately are always told by others that they are crazy. But most people are scared to be called crazy from other people. You need to have the courage to be called crazy. You need to have the courage to present to your family and friends. By declaring to your friends and family, your vision will be solidified. Every time you speak about it, you will get engrossed by your vision. Even if you tell your friends, you will have fear. Just because you have courage doesn't mean you're not afraid. You have fear, but you have to face your fear. You have to have the courage to overcome that fear and become a successful person. It doesn't matter if you're born as a rich person or as a poor person. Your status when you're born does not matter. What determines your life is what kind of dreams you have in your everyday life. So, manipulating the future does not cost any money, and it's really easy. So you must make the most of your future. When your future becomes your present, it must be a future that you had intended it to be. You are not just responsible for yourself. You can't just give up because things are hard. If you give up because it's difficult, then your wife or husband, your parents or your children are all going to collapse with you. That's why you must get back up on your feet. If you succeed, your wife, your husband, your parents and your children can all succeed with you. Because of your loved ones in your heart, you must take courage even if you're afraid. Success belongs to those who are brave. I hope all of you will be successful by mustering up your courage. That's the end of my talk.